Hello po! Andito na naman po ulit kami ni Habi para i-share sa inyo ang part 3 ng aming adventure sa New Zealand. Look at that! Steaming hot! Hello from Hellscape. You wanna go in there or me? Nandito po tayo ngayon sa Hell's Gate, which is located in Rotorua, New Zealand. Sobrang init po ng lugar na ito, kaya tinawag siyang Hell's Gate. Ang mainit na temperatura ng tubig at lupa mula sa lugar na ito ay dahil sa na-develop na geothermal system na dulot ng volcanic activities sa lugar na ito in the last hundreds of thousand years ago. Oh, white guys, it looks like a snow. But what what are they, honey? Sulfur? Sulfur though, yan sila guys. So white. Boiling hot. You can see, diba guys? I'm not sure if makita ba siya, pero bubula sa sobrang init. What is happening under your feet? Mag magma spike. Wow. Ayan guys. Nasa earth core na pala tayo. Ayan. Sobrang init. That is why. It's called health cake. Because it's super duper hot. Burning water. Okay. And siya daw ang nagsabi na ang nagsabi na ito ay Hellscape. He named it. During his week-long visit, the local Maori were so taken by the playwright that formed this that from this time on, they have allowed to the allowed the area to be known in English as Hellscape. George Ben Chul, the writer. In 1900s. Ninja guys, ang writer. George Bernard Shaw ang tumawag sa area na ito na Hellscape Okay, this one here Okay This pool was named after our local Maori princess who tragically took her life resulting in the area being called Tika Territory after her mother found her body. This pool is approximately 50 meters deep. This one, why did she kill her life? Mm. She took a life, she jumped in it. Oh, she jumped in it? Yeah, she took a life, I remember that. She looked and they found her cloak. So if you jump in it, honey, you'll die? <laughs> and this one on the other the side? is 98 degrees Celsius. This is really hot. 98 degrees Celsius. The bukal bukal na This pool appears as a dramatic black crack in the ground. This black color is caused by sulfides and suspended carbons, forming a graphite like appearance. The pools are approximately 20 meters deep with an average pH of 2. Mm. Hellscape, guys. Temperature 45 degrees. The large hot pool has no visible inlet and is constant motion during rising gases. Mm. It was given its name by famous playwright George Bernard Shaw when he visited early 1900s. 25 meters deep. Baby Adam, see? Baby Adam, though, yun. Baby Adam over there. Tawag dyan, guys. Kasi yung playwright na, nag na nagbibigay ng mga pangalan ng mga hot pools na ito it reminded him daw of his nephew na Adam ang pangalan that's why it's called Baby Adam he named all of this place in the 1900s ay bugaya na sobrang tagal na this is how it looks like hubby is just gonna walk see him walking <laughs> look at him walking next one you should say, follow me! With a pH of 
pH of 1.8. Maori used to collect Maori's used to collect water from this pool to treat skin diseases and bites, as well as diluted to use as an insecticide. Ah, so ito daw guys, ang tawag is sulfur bath. Um, even though it's called bath, hindi ka pwedeng maligo dyan kasi sobrang init. But the Maoris, yung mga traditional owners of the land, they um, pick up some some of these, the sulfur bath, they use as medicine and insecticides. Because apparently it's good for your skin, you know, to protect your skin from rashes. And now my hubby is walking again. <laughs> Damn, where are we going now? Yan na guys. Ganito talaga lahat ng itsura guys. Kahit saan. Yung naririnig nyo na parang yan yung ano usok na lumalabas doon sa isa sa mga thermals. Thermal pools. Yan na sabi, malayo na siya. Habulin ko na. Inferno pool. Because if you drop anything there, it will just melt it. What's amazing is that you could be walking around this one area and all the pools are different and all the, the temperatures are different all in the one area. So kahit nasa isang area lang daw ay iba-ibang elements at temperature ang makikita mo sa area na to. This must be one of the hottest guys being the inferno pool. Now the infant, that's the one here. What's the infants about? Kaya naman daw ito tinatawag na infant dahil sobrang diit. Pero kahit maliit ay napaka-active naman ang area na ito. As you can see, napakaliit pero grabe ang pagkulo ng tubig sa sobrang init. Siya, ay, para ka daw nagluluto, uh, naglalagay ng tubig sa frying pan tumatalsik minsan kaya we are always told to for your safety please stay on the foot, foot path dito kasi very unpredictable yellow trees punta tayo sa waterfall Hindi nakakatakot dito kasi hindi naman wala namang ahas. The largest thermal pool in the world daw yan guys. Sobrang init niyan. Are we allowed in it? We are not allowed in it guys. Mga, mga native lang dito sa New Zealand. Yung tinatawag nilang Maori. Mari or Maori? Mari. And there's Abby there. Hi. Beautiful. Ang ganda ng... Look at the yellow trees. It looks yellow. Due to boiling activity, erupting water can reach heights of over three meters. <gasps> On each Jeez. side of the main pool are two others with different colored water. <gasps> These were caused this is the hottest area of the Hell's Gate and it comes sometimes it comes in different colors did you say different um, it's got three different poles oh my god look hindi nyo na nga makita guys it's so bright it's so bright the different colors that's what i just want to show them how big it is in comparison to you see guys there's my husband this is me that's the husband <laughs> and there's the the steaming clips <sighs> kaya pala tinatawag siyang hell's gate sobrang init niya talaga guys so, I suggest don't come here in summer. Hi, Darren. It's hot. <laughs> come here in winter and it's good. 
Ayan pa. Ang layo oh. ng nilakbay namin. How many minutes have we been here, Darn? Just to give an idea how big the hellscape is. An hour, hi. We've been going for 45 minutes. 45 minutes na kami pa ikot-ikot dito sa mga steaming pools na ito. Pero ito daw yung pinakamainit sa lahat. And are there any places like this in the world? Not as active as this, ay. I think you've got to go to America like uh, Yellowstone Park. Oh. Or uh, across in Iceland. Oh, yeah, I Where remember that one. The Iceland one. That's the one I want to see. Yeah. So, grabe. Very special. Thank you, Darren. Thank you, Sir Darren. <laughs> Thank you, Sir Darren. Okay. Hey. It's okay. <laughs> Of course, hindi kumpleto ang visit mo sa Hell's Gate without enjoying their mud bath. Napaka-beneficial po nito sa skin natin. And after the bath, I can honestly tell you, my skin felt so smooth.